it's Erica from Brains to Beauty and today I have a really big haul for you. This is a mix of stuff I've bought in the last few weeks from in store and then stuff I've actually gotten over like the last three months um, via the mail that I just haven't mentioned, haven't even touched. Like I have a tendency to get packages and then throw it off to the side. The first thing I want to talk about is Fit Tea. Um, the biggest reason why I want to talk about this is because this is like a favorite for me like I'm gonna film my favorite sometime soon for August and this is like one of my favorite things and the reason why I say that is because it has been like a miracle I gotta mention this up front I don't like tea I'll be honest I'm not a huge fan of the flavor of this one because I don't like tea and two it has ginger in it and I have like a huge aversion to ginger so anything that has ginger in it I have a tendency to like freak out but I will tell you of all the teas that I've tried out this is a really mild tea so it's not hard to drink and even though I don't like ginger I, I still drink it I do add sugar to it it recommends that you add honey or lemon but I add simple syrup which is homemade it's just one part water one part sugar dissolved together into a syrup it actually is really great it's easy to drink I drink it first thing in the morning morning and this is the 14 day detox it increases your energy levels powerful weight loss supplement it removes toxins from your body it suppresses your appetite it provides energy it's 100% natural as natural antioxidants and they ship this worldwide and the biggest reason why I wanted to try this was because I saw Lizzie trying this out and anything she likes I pretty much jump out and buy immediately because I love pretty much everything she loves. Um, her and I are really good friends and we just happen to have a lot of the same likes and tastes and similarities. And so I had to try this out. She's currently on the 28 day one and she says it's pretty intense. So we're gonna get a little personal here. I, I take the Fit Tea and it keeps me regular. I feel like I've lost weight just from drinking it mostly because it is a huge appetite suppressant. Like. Regardless of the taste, I will continue to drink a ton of this because it has changed the way that I eat. I am the junk food hoarder at work. I have an entire overhead bin at my cubicle and all that's in it is food. And I am the huge snacker. I'm constantly hungry. I'm always eating. I'm probably snacking on the wrong things, which is probably why. Ever since I got Fit Tea, I've like kind of slowed down on the snacking. I'm not snacking as much, so I'm not eating as many unhealthy things as I normally do. I'm fuller faster, which is amazing. And it's just been so great. And I do, I seriously feel like I have tons of energy when I drink this. Normally I'm like this huge coffee drinker. I actually haven't drank coffee since I got fit tea. And for a while I was drinking coffee every day. So this has been a huge like life changer and I'm actually gonna keep drinking it. So. I know this was a haul item and I wasn't supposed to do a review on it, but I really wanted to talk about it because it's like literally a miracle. My husband's starting to drink it now too and he's actually finding that it is really effective. So anyway, done with the fit tea. Next thing I want to talk about mail items is I got some stuff from Born Pretty Store. I ended up getting two stamping plates as well as a container of um, like rhinestones. These different like chrome I don't know what you would call this I would say they're like chrome pattern and then I got this guy which is a picking up tool it's like a pencil it's this waxy material and you can actually sharpen it with a pencil and you can use it to pick up jewels like that and then the two stamping plates I got here are um, QA98 and Q893 most of them are full nail patterns like this guy and then they do have like miscellaneous individual patterns. The next two male products that I got were agave products. I have the agave hair oil and the shampoo and conditioner and I love it. It makes my hair incredibly soft. Like the oil I am obsessed with. And so now I have two new products from them. The first one is the agave healing oil restorative Hydra hydrating mask. Right now I've been using the L'Oreal repair mask I think it is I mentioned it in my last favorites video that stuff is amazing so I'm really excited to try this out and then the next one is the agave revitalizing shine spray and so when I wash my hair I use the oil while my hair is still really damp this is supposed to be used on dry hair so this is something that I'll be using on second day hair when after I use my dry shampoo because sometimes when I use dry shampoo it kind of ends up like drying out my ends and so I'll be using this to like 
bring it back to life. Okay, so the next thing I want to show you is what I'm wearing, and it's TJ Maxx. I got this. I don't know what brand this is, actually. I have absolutely no idea what brand this is. It is a short sleeved product. It is boat neck, and I mistakenly wore like the wrong bra, so it always shows. So I've been like covering it up with my hair. And it's just a really comfortable shirt and I'm excited to be wearing this now that we're like in the fall season. And I love the stripes. The next item I got at TJ Maxx is this Calvin Klein shirt. I actually wore it to work the other day. It does have a gold detail and then it's got the keyhole in the front. It does have what looks like a wrap in the front but it is tied in place so it's not like a loose wrap. In the back it is just a flat cut. In the front though it's a little bit more billowy it has like a stretchy bottom so it looks more like flowy and loose in the front okay the next few products I got from TJ Maxx were not clothing and they were actually in the home goods section of TJ Maxx my TJ Maxx is attached to home goods it's one big giant store instead of like two individual stores the first thing I got is this right here it is a three inch mesh tea infuser and you put loose tea leaves on the inside and this is what you use to steep the tea i didn't have a tea infusers and i had to get it for the fit tea because this fit tea comes in a loose form the next thing i got is this dressings to go i've always seen these in bed bath and beyond and they're like ten dollars at tj maxx no it's this says it compares to five dollars at TJ Maxx I got this for three bucks and it's essentially a silicone bottom with a little cap on the top so you can take your dressing. I've been taking a lot of salads to work recently. The next item I got is this Precision Beauty 2-pack silicone pour scrubbers. So right now I've been using the Vitagood Spin Brush and I use it about twice a week but I always want to use a scrubber for my face and right now I just use my hands. And I had a scrubber like this. It came with a L'Oreal face wash I had once, but it's kind of worn out. So I saw this at TJ Maxx for $4.99, so I went ahead and got it. It's a two-pack, which is really nice. Also, these work as great brush cleaners if you want an inexpensive brush cleaner. I just put baby shampoo on here, and then I just swirl my brush in it because it has the little knobs. They're not very deep, so if you have like bigger brushes, you're really not going to get into the bristles. But it's better than using your hands because usually I use my hands and eventually my hands get like tired. You know, so much abrasion with so many brushes. This actually works just as well. And then the last thing I got from TJ Maxx is this Travalo. And this is one of those travel perfume sprayers. And I got this one in pink. It's got a clear bottom and then a pink cap. And this guy was... $6.99. Normally they sell these for like 20 bucks. So I was like, you know what? I'll try it out. It's pretty nice. Okay, the next thing I want to go into is Charlotte Ruse. The first thing I got is this really cute knit sweater. This is in a size medium. It is in like a baby pink shade. And it has a round neck and it is completely long sleeve. And I figure this would be great. For fall and I am going back to Colorado to see my family for my birthday so I figured this would be fitting because it is starting to get colder there this is like the perfect time to go to Colorado August and September are like the perfect months to go there the next two things I got from Charlotte Russe are two tops these are both um, sleeveless tops I like wearing sleeveless tops to work because one I can wear them in the summer and I can wear them out but at the same time, I can wear them under cardigans or blazers for work so I can convert them to be professional. Okay, the next bag of stuff is Ulta. And I got quite a bit of stuff. I mean, it's not that much, but I got quite a bit. I wanted to get more high-end and then I ended up not buying anything high-end and I am buying a lot of like drugstore products. First of all, I wanted to get some more sh shampoo and conditioner. Um, I'm currently using one that I got from Mimi Box and I'm totally loving it, but I always like to get shampoo and conditioner way before it runs out so that I never have to like worry about it. And I love the L'Oreal Total Repair uh, hair mask and so I ended up getting the shampoo and conditioner of it. And so those are the first two items. Okay, the next item I got is the Real Techniques complexion sponge I am in love like love 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 with my beauty blender I actually almost like splurged 
the $18 for the two minis even though I don't need them for anything because I have a brush that I use from concealer and stuff to get into the creases and everything but I love it so much I thought about it and then I keep hearing that this is a really great dupe so I'm like you know what this is like six dollars or something I'm gonna try this out and see if this is good the next thing I got were lashes they were on sale for like $2.99 I am a huge Andrea lash fan my two favorites are 53 and 21 and then I also got some Ardell in 330s I really like the wispy ones where you almost can't tell you're wearing false lashes and for me since I don't really have lashes these lashes make it look like I have normal lashes which is really nice I'm not a huge fan of like the crazy lashes unless I'm like going out next I got the deep clean long last shine control blotting sheets these are from Neutrogena I used to have some from Sephora that I love they ran out of them and now they're selling them for like nine dollars and I'm like that's just way too expensive and I think this is like five bucks so I got that instead and then the next few products I got is the Rimmel Stay Matte True Beige it's been really rainy and humid here lately and my face has been like a grease ball and I think I'm gonna do a first impression of this and I'm really excited to try it out then the next thing I got is the NYX HD concealer in CW06 this is in glow this is the same shade I used to use before. I totally ran out of my other one. I am currently using Maybelline Fit Me and I really, really like it. But I wanted to get this again because it was such a great concealer and I loved it so much. And yeah, I couldn't get, I just had to have it again. So I got a replacement. And then the last thing I got from Ulta is the L'Oreal Visible Lift Blur Concealer. Kalei has been talking about this a ton and every time she uses it in her videos, I get so excited because it looks so good. I mean, I got this to use as a pre-concealer, something to use under my foundation because I really do have a lot of dark spots. I got this and I'm really excited to try it out and I hope it's as awesome as Clay shows it to be because I trust her. She has a great choice in makeup. Okay, last but not least, I went to Target. I got a bunch of stuff for my husband and something as a late, late, late birthday gift for Lizzie. So I'm not going to show you guys that stuff, but um, she'll be getting it ridiculously late. Sorry, Lizzie. The next product I got is the Vaseline Lip Therapy Trio. I want, I've been seeing these all over the place and they're a little bottle. They're so cute. And I almost bought an individual one of the cocoa butter and then I saw they came in a little set. So I got the set for myself and I'm so excited. Yay. Okay. Anyway, so inside it comes with original rosy lip and cocoa butter. Okay, last two items. So I love going down the travel aisle of Target because they have like the best travel size everything. I like going there for makeup eye remover because I use the Sephora makeup removing oil to remove my makeup. So I don't ever actually need like these little bottles of makeup remover. The reason why I get this is because I also keep, where is it? A little container of q-tips in my beauty blender container and this is so that I can clean up any makeup like if I do my eyes first and I want like a really winged eye I can clean my eye or if I get like mascara on my cheek or if I messed up then I can just touch it up and so I don't ever want to buy like a full makeup remover bottle because it takes me forever to go through like this little travel size one and so it's cheaper and it's already a small size and I can take it on travel if I need to. And the last product is the Herbal Essences Dry Shampoo Color Me Happy Instant Clean and Color Protection. Lizzie mentioned this in her favorites and everything she recommends, I pretty much love. Super excited to try this out. Anyway, so this video is officially 30 minutes long. Hopefully I was good and I managed to edit a lot of the craziness out so that you guys aren't watching like 30 minutes of crazy and that is it thank you guys so much for watching again make sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram so that you guys can get notified of when the actual blog post with the links and the full list of products are up because normally I put up the video with no information and then I later update it so make sure to check that out it'll be out there so you guys can buy stuff that you think you might like and um yeah and of course, make sure to thumbs up if you guys enjoy hauls so that I'll continue to do videos of things that I haul because there's a tendency where I like buy stuff and then I end up not putting the video up because I don't know if it's worth it. 
if you guys like these then I will continue to do them and of course make sure to subscribe to see more videos from yours truly that is it thank you guys so much for watching this is Erica from brains to beauty